have you heard this song? Valentine is coming. Where is your boyfriend? Mm -mm 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 -mm. You are lonely. Mm -mm 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 -mm. <laughs> How did they call this group? This choir is it Kabusa? Kabusa choir. Yes, they removed the verse two of that song. If you didn't watch the verse one last year, look for is it? I think it's Kabusa choir. Okay, find them and watch the, that song. Okay, so guys, hello, welcome to my video today. We are talking about Valentine's Day. Love, 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 love. Everything is red. Everything is between red and pink. <laughs> but mostly red, okay? Because we're talking about the heart and, you know, the beating of the heart. Some people choose one day in a year to celebrate love and then the rest of the year on some food, okay? So guys, today I just want us to talk about Valentine's Day. Usually, Valentine's Day is like a day for couples to say, Oh, I love you. I care about you. Here is a small gift. I love you like this. I love you like that. Okay? And it's always sweet though. Always nice. But the thing is that we believe that Valentine's Day have to be, has to be spent by at least two people. At least two people should gather and spend valentine's day what about those who are alone what about those that they have partners and they are away what about those who do not even have partners at all what about what about what about so yeah is it a crime to spend valentine's day alone for those who believe in valentine's day oh please if you do not care about valentine's day don't come here and start saying oh what is valentine's day baba please I'm talking for those who believe in Valentine's Day, who love Valentine's Day, who appreciate Valentine's Day, and who feel like they should be with somebody to spend Valentine's Day. Because around this period, some people start looking for a partner. Even if it's just for that day, like they are just looking for Valentine, Valentine, to spend their period with. So it's really important to some people, like... So let's talk about it, okay? And I believe that you can spend Valentine's Day on your own, alone, loving yourself. Remember that you are made of flesh and spirit. That is already two people in one, okay? You can spend Valentine's Day by yourself. You don't need to go look for somebody that tomorrow you will regret bringing into your life because you want to spend Valentine's Day. You don't have to be miserable because you didn't receive a gift from somebody for valentine's day you can spend valentine's day with yourself by yourself and around yourself alone okay if you have the means if you have the money take yourself out like maybe you uh, how you expect your partner or whosoever to take you out take yourself out sit down give yourself a treat buy yourself the red roses that you expect to receive buy yourself the red cute gown that you expect to receive and just enjoy your day. Buy yourself the cake or whatever thing that you expect to eat on that day. Enjoy it with yourself. If you're indoors and you can't go out, order something while you're in the house and eat or cook yourself a special meal. Love yourself. Love yourself. Oh. Love yourself first. And I'm saying this especially to, 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 to ladies because we are always at the expecting end. <laughs> But anyway, some ladies use Valentine's Day as an opportunity to give gifts to their to their men. Okay, it's like maybe that's the only time that some men actually get a gift from their girlfriends. Valentine's Day. After that, in, maybe if that day did not exist, forget. <laughs> they will never receive anything from a girl. But all the same, if you're alone, uh, just treat yourself to something nice. Do not. Do not make yourself to feel bad, okay? There's nothing wrong with being alone on Valentine's Day. I know sometimes, some people, like, if you have a circle of friends and they're all talking about the plans they're making with their guys or their husbands and you feel left out because maybe you do not have someone in your life or because maybe your spouse or your, 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 your boyfriend has traveled and or maybe you are not around them, do not feel bad, okay? Just give yourself a treat personal nice simple treat 
go for a massage go for a facial go for a manicure or a pedicure do something special for yourself so that you feel good and your mind is also busy because if you're also sitting maybe watching tv the whole tv is going to be red that day social media is going to be red you will not be able to survive it if you are the type of person who is so sensitive to valentine's day so please let me advise you find an activity to do for yourself on valentine's day so that you do not go looking and envying other people who are having a wonderful valentine's day so guys i just wanted to hop in and tell you guys that valentine is coming if you don't have a boyfriend you better find a way to spend your valentine by yourself and enjoy it by yourself and just let it pass love can always be celebrated on any other day okay it's not because one human being died on the 14th of february that's for the for the sake of love that we would oh i don't know how what story is it even behind valentine's day he was always writing about love or talking about love i think and i think it's the day he died i cannot really remember what happened but i think it's either the day he died or something that they decided to celebrate that day and his name was valentine so well celebrate love when you have that person in front of you celebrate love when you have the opportunity to do so and don't put it all on valentine's day because when you put it all on valentine's day and it cannot work the way you want you would feel so bad so guys thank you for watching this video hope it helped and it calmed some spirits some valentine spirits <laughs> hope it has calmed your valentine spirit and it has put you in a good mood to know that you need to take care of your body and your soul if you do not have a soul mate take care of your body and your soul if you do not have a soul mate body and soul is only two people people who spend valentine's day body and soul together in your house or wherever you choose do something for your body do something for your soul your soul you can try to meditate be at peace okay do something calming and then for your body take care of your body eat something nice go out for a treat go for a massage or anything nice buy yourself a nice dress and wear on your body and feel good about yourself okay so thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye and happy Valentine's Day in advance. Bye bye.